Hello heroes and villains, welcome to Multiverse. Today we are going to take a look at the Ocean Queen hair and the Atlantean Emperor hairstyle. So let's get this party started. As seeing how we already have it equipped, let us start with the Atlantean hairstyle. So basically it is the official Aquaman hairstyle that we have in this universe online. So if you have an Aquaman character and you wanted to have the official Aquaman hairstyle, now you can. And where or where can we get the hairstyle? The hairstyle comes from the Valentine Seasonal Vendor. So sadly, it will be available for a limited amount of time. So you can see here the Atlantean Emperor hairstyle for 25 hearts. So sadly, you will have to purchase it during the Valentine Seasonal. If you miss out for some reason, you will have to wait until next year. Also, I'm sure some of you guys will ask where or where can we get some hearts? Uh, you get some hearts playing the Valentine Seasonal missions. And there's a mission that our friend Hal Jordan can give us. And there's also the 4 player Valentine Seasonal mission you can play from the on duty menu. But again, this event is available only for a limited amount of time. Although if you miss out on the event, there might be one option. If you miss out on the Valentine Seasonal for whatever reasons, you could take a look at the broker. So you can see right now the broker, it starts at 100 million, but it goes down to a bit less than 40 million. I have to give my usual broker warning, prices on the broker changes all the time. These are the prices on the broker right now. Tomorrow, next week, next month, and clearly tonight, the prices could be different. Also, a question that often, often comes back, how can we make money in this universe online? This would be how. Purchase a whole bunch of Atlantean Emperor hair from the Valentine Seasonal Vendor and sell them on the broker. You could try to sell them right now, or you could wait uh, for next summer. And basically right now, the price the price are still fairly high, as you can see, like you can get uh, basically roughly 40 million for the, the hairstyle. But when the Valentine Seasonal will end, the price of the hairstyles should go up and up and up until we can actually get it again next year. So if you wait until roughly next summer, you should be able to get a pretty good price for the Atlantean Emperor hair. Assuming you can wait that long before you need to sell the hairstyle. And now let us take a look at the Ocean Queen hair. Normally I tell you a bit later where or where you can get it, but obviously as you can see, you can get it from the, from the Dr. Fate's daily rewards. You have to log in for 21 days and you have to be a subscriber. And you can see there's still seven days left. So sadly, if you start logging in only today, you're not going to be able to get the hairstyle from the daily rewards, but there are still going to be an option to be able to get the hairstyle. We'll take, we'll take a look at that in just a minute. So let us claim all the daily rewards for today. And you can see the hairstyle is account bound. So if somehow you collect it on the wrong character, don't worry, you can use the shared bank to give it to any, to any one of your other characters. So let us consume the hairstyle. There was a bit of lag there. And as you saw, it does not give a feat when you consume it. Usually the rewards you get from the daily rewards do not grant you a feat unless when they reuse an older style, like when they reuse, let's say the hunter style, well the hunter style does give you a feat. So if somehow you did not, uh, you did not have the feat for the hunter style before and then you get the style from the daily rewards, yes, you will get the feat for that. But new items like the ocean hairstyle, uh, these do not grant feats. So let's equip the hairstyle. Holy crap. Uh, let's get a chest piece that is a bit less bulky. So here you can see what the hairstyle looks like. Obviously you can change the colors of the hairstyle. I don't think it's a style I would uh, really have asked for, but I'm sure some people are very happy to get the Mara hairstyle. This is the official Mara hairstyle from the game. And what if you want to have the hairstyle on an alternate character? Uh, you can use replay badges to purchase the style. And it will cost you 50 replay badges to unlock the style for your alternate characters. Uh, let's try it with another armory. So here the style works well enough if your character is wearing some sort of tiara. Uh, I did not really want to use the 50 replay badges to purchase the style, but uh, let's do it. So yeah, I guess the style is pretty much built to, to wear some sort of tiara because the... Uh, let's remove the tiara. It does feel, I wouldn't say unfinished, but it, it does feel weird without the tiara. I guess they didn't want to read too much about the uh, Mera's hairline, seeing how there was a tiara to cover it anyway.
So again, you have to log in for 21 days in order to be able to collect the hairstyle and you have to be a subscriber, so you have to do both. If somehow you were not able to log in for 21 days just yet, uh, you can see there's only 7 days left. So you could decide to subscribe now to get the hairstyle, but if you did not log in for 21 days, you are not going to be able to get the hairstyle even if you are a subscriber. If you miss out on the hairstyle for whatever reason, there will be an alternative. Eventually the hairstyle will be available on the Dr. Fade vendor. So if we go to the Styles tab, so you can see we have the, some of the previous rewards. We have the Two-Tone Cape, we have the Lord of Chaos Accessory, we have the Helmet of Naboo's Chosen. So roughly in 3 months, if somehow you did not get the hairstyle for your character, you should be able to get it for, from Dr. Fate, but it is going to cost you Destiny Tokens. I'm not sure why some of the rewards cost 1 Destiny Tokens if you are subscribers. If you are not a subscriber, some of those rewards will cost you 2 Destiny Tokens. And seeing how I'm not a free-to-play player, I cannot tell you which is which. I'm not sure why some will cost 1 Destiny Token and some will cost 2 Destiny Tokens. I'm sure there's a reason behind it, I just cannot tell you what it is. So if you miss out on collecting the hairstyle from the daily rewards, don't worry, it will be available in the Dr. Fate vendor, but you may have to wait roughly 3 months before you can purchase it from Dr. Fate. I realize I guess the hairstyle could work for pretty much any long haired character. I guess our friend Dr. Samson from Marvel would qualify. If you want to see more videos, click one of the videos that you see on your screen right now.